bucks. Like, oh, nar. Oh, oh, wait. Oh, no. I, I, I messed it up. Oh, no. Ah. Get it. <laughs> ah. There we go. Okay, better. Hey! Hi. <laughs> I'm Michael, and I play Mark in Sketched Out. Hi, I'm Kelsey, and I play Olivia in Sketched Out. And, and today, today, we'll be doing the <laughs> Best Friends, Best Friends Challenge. Challenge. Do you want to start? Sure, yeah, okay. Um, okay, I'm gonna start with the most iconic one. Do they have a nickname? Yes, they do. You have a really iconic nickname. <laughs> uh, Markle is what we call him. Um, sometimes we call him Megan, obviously. Um, and it's just a combination Not of Not obvious to everyone. Okay. Megan Markle, in case... Okay. Anyway. <laughs> okay. Um, and it's basically we all have nicknames that are like com combinations of our character names and our real names. So that's it. <laughs> uh, Kelsey. Yes. How would I describe Kelsey in one word? Effervescent. She's just like this oh. bubbly, like beautiful soul that just brings such like a warm energy to set. Oh. Welcome to the best friends challenge. <laughs> that would would be cry. Really <laughs> okay, how many languages do they speak? Okay, Michael, I know that you speak definitely two. Is two correct? It's a, can I answer? It's a little more than two. Okay, you speak three? So, if we're gonna be like, totally honest, it's like. English and a fair amount of Spanish, and then a okay. smattering of whatever country I've been to in the past like six years. Kelsey, what is the nerdiest thing about them? I think the nerdiest thing about Kelsey, and I don't know if this is just because of her character on set, but the way that someone holds a baby Yoda is very indicative, I think, of how much they love Grogu. And I think the nerdiest thing about Kelsey would have to be her possession with Baby Yoda. Yeah. yeah. I, I would partially agree with that, actually. Yeah, yeah. It's up yeah. there. Yeah. I, sure I, I love that doll. It's it was it was a big part of one of those episodes. Mm. So. <laughs> what is the most surprising thing about Michael? Um something that I was really surprised about Michael about, like when I first met him, is that his phone is all in Spanish. <laughs> and considering the last que question, how many languages? does he speak the fact that he doesn't speak like fluent Spanish or at least from what you said the fact that your phone is all in Spanish is pretty surprising I would say yeah I can speak fluent phone Spanish sometimes um <laughs> sometimes um navigating the settings is a bit difficult yeah <laughs> um but you know, we make it work yeah off of the sacred language okay is Kelsey a dog or a cat person that's a really tough one. I think I'm gonna go with cat person. Ooh. Oh, did I get it wrong? See, it, I could, I could see you going both ways. See, I do like both. I, I wouldn't say that I have like an affinity towards either. I really like both, but I have, I have never had my own cat. So I think just like by having my own dogs in the past. What would be their villain origin story? It's a good one. Okay. Michael's villain, villain origin story. Hmm. I feel like it would be uh, from like most of my time with you is either on set or in the car. Mm. So I feel like it would be um, <laughs> missing your exit too many times and. <laughs> <laughs> Drag me. <laughs> Missing your exit too many times, and then ending up in the wrong place, and then, yeah. Oh, I kind of love that. Yeah. Where, where do I end up? Well, considering that today we ended up on two wrong exits on the 110. That makes me sound like a terrible <laughs> driver. Okay, well, you're not a terrible driver. You just you weren't looking at the navigation. That was the only problem. Oh, I wasn't. <laughs> you know, when I have good company in the car, I just kind of trust my instincts. and. Yeah, that's, that's how we ended up getting off a couple of exits. But we were on the right side of downtown LA. Yeah. So. We made it. We, we made it. We picked up our co star. It was fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
<laughs> See, the other side would have been my villain origin story. Oh, for sure. Yeah. What would our superhero duo be called? Ooh. Oh God, I feel like we'd be that like cliche, like Wonder Twins, like star power, like positivity vibe. Oh. Like so someone's having a bad day, we pop up and we're like, it's gonna be fine. And then like, stars shoot out of our hands and then people feel better. Exactly. So let's call, we're gonna call us, ready, ready, we're doing a little like, mm -hmm. little okay. hands. Yep. Wonder star. Yeah, that's our, you'll be wonder and I'll be star. <gasps> that's, that's kind that's of pretty, iconic. That's kind of iconic. That is kind of iconic. Wonder star. Okay. What's their go-to song in the car? <laughs> So, for context of why we're laughing, we were just listening to Michael's throwback playlist from when he was in high school and college. And he has this alphabetical playlist, and we are on C right now. It's gonna be a while. It's gonna be season 10 before we get to the end of that playlist, but we, we will get there eventually. We listen to um, a lot of different variations of songs, and I think go-to song in the car is acapella. Oh, <laughs> absolutely. Of course. Especially if we're talking about like throwbacks. Mm. It was like all I listened to for a good year. For sure. Yeah. Do they prefer DC or Marvel? Kelsey's the biggest Marvel fan I know. DC can rock. I think my character kind of speaks for that, for sure. If you if you knew what the character was originally called before we named her, it's, it's pretty, pretty obvious what the answer to that question is. <laughs> Okay. Take it away? Yeah. When is their birthday? I'm gonna be so, so honest with you. Go for it. I don't know a birthday from an apple. And that's a new saying I just made up. <laughs> okay, great, great. <laughs> um, okay, I'm just gonna take a wild guess. Go for it. I think I remember you saying your birthday was in the summer. Am I in the right ballpark? No? Ooh. Okay, okay, winter, winter, yeah, winter, right, right, okay. Right, right closer. Um, wild guess, January 28th. Wow, she was four days off. That's okay. impressive, it's January 24th. Okay, um, that's okay. That's a very impressive guess. Don't know how you did that. It's that wonder star psychic mm. ability. It's one of our powers. We also have, add it to the list. For sure. Mm -hmm. Does Kelsey have a hidden talent? Well, if it was hidden, then I wouldn't know about it. But if you did have a hidden talent that I didn't want anyone else to know about, it would probably be. I bet you're like really ambidextrous. I used to be ambidextrous, actually. Uh, when I was younger, I used to be, but I am, I am no longer. I'm, I'm left-handed. So basically, to keep a long story short, I was taught like to be left-handed when I was a kid and I was learning to write, but then my school taught me everything right-handed. And so for like a couple year period, I was actually ambidextrous. But then I switched schools. I don't think I did this one. Favorite memory of them? It's probably a tie uh, between many moments in- <laughs> It's not a tie. It's not literally, <laughs> sorry. Not, not a tie, but a tie between two moments. One of which in the car, obviously. We spend a lot of time in the car together. Probably just one of the times that we were like singing together happens harmonizing, of course. Mm. A different time was on set and you and Paul we're talking in like valley girl accents. Accents, dialects, I don't know what to call it, but they were just talking about things that were ill and unill. And they it, this went on for a solid like five minutes. I have videos of it. Like a lot of a lot of the crew has videos of it too, because it was it just went on forever, but it was it was really funny. Does Kelsey have any siblings? We've actually been doing so well so far, so I'm surprised no. it got to hear. My guess, I wanna say no. I wanna say her only job. It's kind of a trick question, Okay. actually. Yes and no, because I do have two brothers, but they are my half brothers, and they're quite a bit older than me. But yes, I do technically have biological siblings, too. Oh. Now we know. Mm -hmm. Who would play them in a movie? That is a great question. And honestly, I think it's a really unique look. I mean, I don't oh, know. Thanks. I can't think of anybody. That's tricky, right? Like, at least, like, visually, that could play you. 
you know. Tune in next time to find yeah, out if honestly, we ever figure out who geez. might. <laughs> maybe maybe we'll circle back. Maybe yeah, we'll, yeah. we'll circle back. But I mean, I think it I think it's a compliment that you, you have a unique look, right? Thanks, Kelsey. Yeah. What is Kelsey's favorite movie? If I know what I know about Kelsey and her love for certain films, maybe like classic Iron Man. Maybe like Iron Man One, like the start of it all. I think that is. He's like, it could be up there. Maybe not the favorite, but I think it's yeah, up there. It's that's not number one, but it, I would consider that to be at the very least in like my top three, probably wow, of okay. Marvel movies, like generally. But like, you gotta know what the top one is now, though. I would say generally, probably like Avengers Endgame. I would say like. I was gonna say Endgame, but that seemed like. Such I feel a, like there's just there's so much answer. in the movie. It's a long movie, it's and true. so you can it's watch epic. different parts of the movie to get different things. You know, like you have like the sad moments, and you have like the fun moments, and you yeah. have that really epic ending. Like, I don't think it's my number one movie overall, but if I had to watch one movie, or if I could only watch one movie for like the rest of my life, it would probably be that. Uh, what is their favorite Disney movie? We're, we're kind of staying in the, yeah, yeah, yeah. the same realm of movies here. Um, Beauty and the Beast? That is actually one of my favorites. Okay, it's okay. not like my favorite favorite, but it's it's up there. Same okay. thing with Iron Man. It's like yeah, top yeah, it's, three. It's really good, but it's not like number one. Right. I mean, Her Her Hercules. It's gotta be Hercules. Okay. It's, yeah. it's untouchable. The whole thing is great. The yeah. comedy in Hercules, I think, like raised me. Mm -hmm. Like, that's just, that's just me. Yeah. R is Kelsey, an introvert or an extrovert. Reserved, talkative, but like once you really get to know her and she like starts trusting me, she opens up. So I would say we're kind of like where we're, I would say I'm like an extrovert with introverted tendencies or like need my time and space occasionally. I would say maybe you're like an introvert with extroverted tendencies. Is that fair? Um, yeah. I um I would I would say that that's that's pretty accurate because I am like someone that has to get to know you before I'm actually like my crazy yeah. self. So I mean, enjoy my crazy self. In you this should interview, be so clearly. lucky. Yeah. yeah, you're welcome. <laughs> wow. Is this this is my final question? Who is their celebrity crush? My my crush crushes okay. for my crush crushes it like. It's the whole package, you know? Right, yeah. Looks, personality. Okay. RDJ? Really What's that again? RDJ? No! So close. I could feel that. Give me like 10 years. Like every, yeah. I feel like every 10 years, like your Marvel celebrity crush. Oh, for sure, for sure. Changes, but it's gotta be Captain. I mean, it's Daddy America. Damn it! It's, I was going, Chris. I was it's going that to old say Chris. Cool, old fashioned, like timeless. <laughs> and that ass, I mean, <laughs> like, yeah, America's ass. How can you how can you say no to that? And this is yes, I've answered them all or asked them all except for this one. How tall is Kelsey? We're about the same height, right? I also feel Are like we? we're doing like about the same pose and we're about the same height here. <laughs> like maybe you got a couple inches on the knees. Really? Maybe I make up for. Should we find we, out? Should we stand up? Are we should gonna we, be in frame? Are we able to stand up? Okay. Let's try. Let's try. Okay, here we go. Ha! I was. Oh no! I I got a couple inches on Kelsey. Yeah. Cool. Generally. Okay, guess, guess how you're tall probably, I You're probably, you're like 5'5". Five, 5'4". Five. Five, Ish. Yeah, I'm like, I'm like, okay. See, everybody, five, eight, I was measured, I was measured as man. like 5'3", like by my doctor. But everybody never, like no one believes me when I say I'm 5'3". I give you 5'5". Five, five. Okay. Wow. I feel like we, we're just so much closer now. I know. We, a, a lot of these uh, answers were guesses, but we, we were in the ballpark. Totally. It, for I mean, a lot of it, we were in the It's just about, it was about the vibe. For sure. One last time, for the people at home. Sure. One star. Oh, that was a really good one. That was a really good one. <laughs> okay. our, our voices like mesh really well. That was yeah. good, that was uh, good. Um, anyway, so this was our best friends challenge. I'm Kelsey. And I'm Michael. And Wonderstar. <laughs> and don't forget to check out Sketched Out on Culture Slate.